What's going on guys, my name is Xanaviz, and today I'm just going to be doing a really quick video on some of the new cars that came out um, with this uh, new season change. I'm just going to check out one of them right now because I really need to do something after this, but right here it says the VW Gia, right, the 50% complete after you complete 50% of the autumn season. And if you complete the season event, you get this other car over here, which I don't remember the name of, but, I mean, I guess we can try them out. So, I know what one of them is, I don't remember what the other one was, and I don't know how to check which one is new, or like how to get back to it, so, we're probably just going to be doing the Gia, like really quick. I know I usually do like a really long intro, but I'm just trying to get into it now and see if you guys like it. If you do, hit the li hit the like button and comment down below if a shorter intro is better than what I usually do. Right now I'm just trying to find the car, so I'm just trying to make conversation. What was the name of the other one? Is it also a Volkswagen? Are they both Volkswagens? Um, is it this one? I think it's this one. Because this one came out with the 50% and then this one I think comes out. I'm gonna do this one. So let's just get in this one. Let's see how it drives. Probably not that fast. But we're gonna go upgrade it. So let's head over to the nearest house which is right here. We can just drive there that way we can see how this thing does. Not a lot of wheel spin. Oh my goodness, this thing is slow. First gear at like 25, second, almost at 50. Going into third. It has some very, very, very soft and bubbly suspension. Third up at 80. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's it just slides everywhere. Not like a good slide either. It's more of a it's more of an oomph type of slide where it's like uh, it's like a lazy slide. There you go. Turn right. It cannot drift. Not stock. Let's see what we can do with it. Let's go into the house. All right, let's go to garage. My cars. Oh, whoops, not that one. Garage upgrades, custom. See what we can do in, with conversions. We can stick a turbo on the on the stock engine. It comes with 65 horsepower, 87 foot-pounds of torque. It weighs 2,000 pounds. Oof. Um, I can put F6, 493. If I throw a turbo on, how much? It just boosts it up like 7 horsepower if I throw a turbo on. Oh, 13. Gives you a lot more torque though. Look at that. That's like 13 plus 5. That's 18 foot pounds of torque. It adds. Um, I am going to put 278.3. I'll just throw in the biggest one. I will not make it all wheel drive. I'll throw some turbos on. Because why not? What can we do? What? They gave us bumpers? What the heck? This is like one of the very few cars that have come out that give you like actual bumpers uh i like this one actually no i like the other one better this one in the rear 
Oh, Legend of the Roof Rack. And then, just a spoiler. I wish you could put the Roof Rack and the spoiler at the same time. I feel like Forza should really, really let you do that, but apparently not. Oh, more bumpers. This is match the front. Going for like a real classy look. We need to make it seem like we don't have a lot of horsepower, guys. We need to make it seem like, um, like we're just, like we're just this random type three over here with some fat tires. Uh, oh, we have the wheel track with. Boom. Yes, please. In the front. Uh, not as much as I wanted. It's not really level, but it'll do. It'll do. Wheels. Can't forget about the wheels. Oh, snap. Oh, no, not these. Something. Something that looks old, but is pretty modern. That would look good on this thing. Uh, I really don't know. I honestly don't know. Um, I'll put these. They probably don't look the best, but I'm not going to spend too much time on that. I'm just going to upgrade and then just put everything over here to race. We don't need none of that slow stuff. We want to see what this thing can do. Oh, shoot. Suspension. Oh. Oh, look at that. Oh, my God. Uh. We'll do this one. No, let's not add a roll cage. Subtract some weight. And fully upgrade the engine. See what type of numbers we're pulling out now. Exhaust. Camshafts. Ignition valves. Wait, those aren't ignition. Those are just valves. Twin turbos. Yes. Another intercooler. Go for it. And a flywheel. Subtract me some weight. A hundred thousand basically to fully max out this car. Install setup. Install setup. I feel like upgrading cars in this game is a lot more easier than upgrading them in GTA 5. In Grand Theft Auto 5, you need like hundreds of thousands of dollars just to buy one car and then like another 200 grand to fully upgrade it. It's just, it's insane. Rockstar needs to like fix that because it's, it's too much, man. All right, let's see what this thing can do. Ooh, it's a drifty boy. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I probably should have put on drift suspension if I'm going to be, like, drifting it around. If you guys are just going to drift it around, I recommend drift suspension. It's not a bad car after you upgrade it. You, do, you really need drift suspension. Or... I mean, what if we throw on drag, drag tires? Cause like, it's not stable. I mean, yes, I can just upgrade, or not upgrade, I can just tune the gears. That way it doesn't spin as much and lower the tire pressure. But I feel like drag tires would really help this thing. Maybe not in the turning, because this thing cannot turn for crap either. Nope, it does not. You'd have to drift. It's like the... What was I using a lot? I think it was the... I think it was the 6x6 where you, ha where you have to drift it in order to turn. Oh, look. In a long turn like that, it does really good. Let's see these little short turns right here. See if it'll drift. No, 
Yeah, I need drift suspension. Drift suspension and then a lot of feathering of the throttle because just like that is very difficult to control it. Oh, maybe. No. No. Eh. I give it like a like a B maybe. Like a B in the in the drift area. You have arrived at your destination. Cuz it it seems stable with a drift. It's not stable when you're trying to drive it in a straight line. Like off of a launch, if you're trying to drive it off of a launch, if you're trying to drive it in a straight line, I highly doubt you're going to be going in a straight line. You have arrived at your destination. Let's go over to the drag strip really quick. We'll put in put in a little quick quick drag strip run. A little quick run at the strip. Oh, can you break? It does not break either. Does it break? Nope, it like sends you packing. just sneezed like twice but I muted my mic because I don't want you guys to hear that but let's see how this thing goes in a straight line can we do a launch wait there we go nope I tried to control it and it didn't let me Ah, sorry. What type of tunes did people make for this? Because I was watching AR12 Gaming, and I think it was either this one or the other, or the other new car, where they released or they made a, a drag tune that lets you pop wheelies how do you go to load setup oh here it is uh, a class road wow drift monster wheelie tune wheelie tune wheelie road seasonal notchback drift beast Top rally, best wheelie car. Slammed 310 miles an hour? Bro. Bro, you're lying. You're lying, bro. I highly doubt this thing will make it a three, 310. It'll be one of the fastest cars if it's a 310. Wheelie, wheelie. 320. Okay, this is the second person I've seen who puts a super high amount of Bro, I don't think. <laughs> okay. We'll try the wheelie first, and then we'll go to the... What do you call it? We'll go to the causeway, or the expressway, or whatever the heck these people call it in Britain. And see if it'll freaking go... 300 miles an hour, which I highly doubt, but we can try it. Let's see if this thing will do a wheelie first. Hold up. So we stop at the line. 
I assume. Oh! Oh! It will be. Oh my goodness. Hold up. Wait, 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 wait. I wanted to see how far can you wheelie. They should really make that like a uh, like a record. Okay, I can't do it like that. Nope. So confirmed it will do a wheelie. Can we do wheelie donuts? <gasps> we can do wheelie donuts in this thing. Holy shoot. What if I shift back to... No, shift the back up. Okay. Bro. Bruh. Bruv. Oh my goodness. Oh. We're doing wheelie donuts. Nowhere else will you ever see Wheelie Donuts in a video game. Forza Horizon 4, probably the only game I've ever seen that you can do Wheelie Donuts in. That's so cool. Alright, enough of that. Let's try and see the supposedly... 320 miles an hour tune where is it ah uh, right here wait what incompatible parts what are you talking about Okay, I can put this one in, but it's not letting me put the other one in. I've never had that come up on on anything where it says uh, where it says incompatible parts. Well, I guess we're stuck with this one. It still says 310, so let's go test it out over here. Just fast travel over there really quick. Here we go. Okay, I have a feeling controlling this might be a little bit difficult. Alright, ready? Here we go. Launching in second, because I'm just going to get a buttload of wheel spin if I do it in first. Okay. Um, I think that tune is a lie. Maybe 210 max, because I'm early on 160 trying, I'm in fifth gear. And it, it seems like it's already slowing down. Oh my god. I can't. Traffic in this game is so stupid. Yeah, it, this thing will not hit 310. I don't know what the heck type of drug they were doing um, but it will not hit 310 miles an hour what am I doing well guys uh, I'm gonna wrap it off here because 
Actually, you know what? Hold up. How do you guys? How do you guys are solid? I don't understand what it means by incompatible parts. It's ridiculous. Why does it say that? Why does it say incompatible? There we go. Unbelievable. Okay, there. Do you guys this uh I'm gonna end it off by doing you guys a solid there we go guys wheelie donuts the 310 tune was kind of disappointing, but this one is not. I highly recommend this car. It's a very good car for doing, well, wheelie donuts and wheelies. If you guys like, if you guys like wheelies, I recommend it. Especially wheelie donuts, because uh, they're pretty fun. All I'm doing is holding the gas. You guys don't even understand how easy it is to do this either. Um, but yeah, that's going to be it. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, comment down below what you liked about the video and what other videos you would like for me to do. Um, what else? What else? What else? Be sure to be sure to follow Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. They're all going to be linked in the description below, like they always are. And thanks a ton for watching, guys. Um, I really need to do like an outro because I don't know what to say but thanks a ton for watching I hope you enjoyed and I'm doing a new thing this is this is why I'm saying like I need to do an outro but this I think this would be my outro uh, thanks a ton for watching I hope you guys liked it I hope you guys enjoyed it and above all else stay legendary